Thanks, Lauren. After months of stakeholder engagement, we're thrilled to announce the launch of the U.S. Plastics Act. This collaboration led by the Recycling Partnership, World Wildlife Fund, and the Ellen MacArthur Foundation is bringing together more than 60 public and private stakeholders across the plastics value chain to rethink the way we design, use, and reuse plastics. The past has shown that individual action, while important, is not enough. That's why these industry leaders, including major retailers, brands, suppliers, governments, and organizations are coming together to catalyze the system-wide change needed. Transitioning to a circular economy for plastics will require unprecedented collaboration and innovation. The PACT is providing the pre-competitive platform to accelerate industry-led action, enabling companies and governments to collectively meet impactful goals that they could not meet on their own. World Wildlife Fund is so glad to be a part of this. We are at the cups of real transformation and we see that the pact is a key catalyst to facilitate this. Uh, and of course the US is a critical region for transforming um, the broken system of plastic pollution. Because today Americans account for about 5% of the world's population, but are creating half of the world's waste. And over 72% of that is ending up in landfills. This means that it's not being recycled and it's not being circulated back into the material market for use, therefore losing market value and ultimately perpetuating the use of more virgin plastic. So the PAC's targets are designed to stop waste of material by eliminating problematic and unnecessary plastic items and innovating to ensure that all plastic packaging is reusable, recyclable, and compostable, and circulating plastics to keep them in the economy and out of the environment. We can't do any of that without collaboration. This is a complex system, and so we need to work from the local level to the national level, from businesses to governments, and of course, all of this tw working towards common goals. In this crisis, the only way to implement a systems change is to measure exactly what we're doing. We know, um, understanding there from where, there what our pain points are that we need to address and then what levers we need to pull to solve for this. These levers for change are then reflected in the PAC's four time-bound ambitious goals. The PAC activators have all committed today to publicly report and make progress collectively towards these targets with us. The US Plastics Pact is committed to define a list of problematic or unnecessary packaging by 2021 and take measures to eliminate them by 2025, ensure all plastic packaging is 100% reusable, recyclable, or compostable, undertake ambitious actions to effectively recycle or compost 50% 50, 50 of plastic packaging, and ensure the average recycled content or responsibly sourced bio-based content in plastic packaging will be 30%. This is the first time that key public and private stakeholders across the entire U.S. plastics value chain, from government to businesses and NGOs, come together to collectively work towards those four bold 20, 20, 25 targets. The Ellen MacArthur Foundation is excited to welcome the U.S. to our global network, joining seven other plastic pacts on three other continents, all united behind one common vision and committed to ambitious 2025 targets. Together with over 850 organizations around the world, the US Plastics Pact activators will be working towards a circular economy for plastic in which it never becomes waste or pollution. We look forward to collaborating with them to deliver real step change towards making this vision a reality in the United States. Now for the moment you've been waiting for. Here is a sneak peek at the more than 60 activators of the U.S. Plastics Pact. Through this unprecedented effort, retailers, brands, plastic packaging producers, recyclers, state government agencies, local municipalities, industry organizations, academia, and nonprofit organizations are coming together with stakeholders from across the entire plastics value chain to accelerate progress toward the circular economy for plastics in the U.S. This is just the first step on this journey. Together with these leaders, we will build the roadmap, laying out the steps to achieve the 2025 targets. PACS activators will play a critical role in the development of this action plan. 
there is still time to be part of this influential process and the many actions that will occur leading up to 2025. We encourage stakeholders within the plastics value chain to join us by going to usplasticspack.org. You can also learn more during our virtual roundtable session later today and at tomorrow's breakout session. Thank you to GreenBiz for hosting this inspirational event. And to all of our founding activators and supporters of the US Pact, thank you for taking this critical step. We hope many more of you will join us to be part of the solution to building a circular economy together.